to you. And to wish us a happy 50th. You know, when you start out on 50 years, it seems a long way off. It's like the story of the little boy who's going to start school, kindergarten. And his mother had instructed him that he should do whatever the teacher told him. And he should be a good boy. He should behave. And she also impressed on him that he must go to school for 15 years. So the first day he had to go to school, his mother took him down, left him at the desk for the teacher, said, this is Tommy. He has promised to be a good boy. He's going to do what his teacher tells him. And he's going to behave well. And she turned around to go home. The little fella he grabbed his mother and Give her a big kiss from mommy. Will you be here to pick me up in 15 years? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, when you look ahead, it seems like a long time. I also remember a little deal like this marriage and all that. A public accountant told me one time that marriage is a mutual partnership. And he said it works very well if either one or the other of the partners remain mute whenever necessary. <laughs> but we are sure glad you all could come. I want to thank you a lot. I don't know. Sometimes it's been uphill, sometimes downhill, mostly downhill. <laughs> but I, I'll tell you a little story kind of along those lines. Uh, two old people that had, had domestic difficulties. They were sitting out on the back porch, one in one end, one on the other end, in a rocking chair. They were rocking, but they weren't talking. And you remember the old coal wagons, livery wagons where the old coal would break in. There was one of them coming up the street and it was pretty heavy loaded with coal. And the uh, horses they had an incline to go up and they had evidently had run up there many times because when they got close to the incline, both the horses lunged into their harness and went right up to the top. And finally the old lady, she couldn't stand it no more. And she turned around, she looked at her husband and said, John, why couldn't we pull together like those horses? John happened to be a quick wit and he said, yes, and we could. If we were like that team of horses and only had one tongue between them. <laughs> After that, I don't think I should say a word. <laughs> Thank you all for coming. This is a lovely day. The sun shone after the rain. This is so much fun. I can cry. <laughs>